Oh my god! It's finally here! Oh my god! Skyrim! Okay. Okay. For those of y'all who don't know, which is the majority of y'all, back when I was in 360, Skyrim was my favorite game. Oh my god! God, I love Skyrim so freaking much. Today, I got done working. And I had been working for my youth pastor's mom for the past two days when I've been moving furniture. And she paid me $80. And I said, I'm gonna slide over to GameStop and get me a $60 um, online card. And I'm gonna get Skyrim. So Phil and I can play Skyrim now. And Phil's not here right now. He's playing Xenoverse. And Skyrim is still downloading for him. Oh my gosh, I love Skyrim. I can sing this, oh my gosh, Song of the Dragonborn. Oh, I love it so much. I can sing that all day. I love Song of the Dragonborn. Oh my god. So, like, I know a lot about the Elder Scrolls series, but I've only played Skyrim. Because I've been, oh, I've done so much freaking research on YouTube and crap and online. Oh my gosh. Oh. Let's get started. Now, when I upload this, I want y'all to comment whether y'all want me to, whatchamacallit, do a full playthrough or not. And I, and, um... What you might call it? Um, if I do do the, um, an online play, uh, not online playthrough, but um, a playthrough, I won't show the grinding and whatnot for levels. Now, Skyrim Special Edition, um, they didn't touch the character models per se, but the environmental models they touched up. And I've played on the Xbox One with some friends. Um, my youth group had guys night one night, and oh my god. Oh my god, it's so freaking pretty. <laughs> like, see, the character models are the same. But look at the environmental models. Oh my gosh. Oh god, it's so pretty. I worked for this. I earned this. I am so freaking happy. Hey, you. Finally awake. God, it's been forever since I played Skyrim. I can't remember your name. You the border, right? Walk right into that Imperial ambush. Same as us. And that thief over there. Damn you Stormcloaks. Skyrim was fine until um, the Empire was nice and lazy. Yeah. They hadn't been looking for you. I can't remember if he's a red guard or not. Hammerfell. You then. He is, um, Captain Stormcloak. Ulfric Stormcloak is his name, yeah, Ulfric. We're all brothers and sisters in fine His name starts with a B, if I can remember. What's up back there? What's wrong with Shut your mouth. mouth. Watch your tongue. You're speaking to Ulfric Stormcloak. Yeah, Ulfric. The true high king. So, um, the no so if y'all don't know, the Stormcloaks... They're kind. They're a little racist. Like they don't let Nords. You know, I'm sorry. They they only let Nords into the Stormcloaks, except for your character. And I think I, um, you have to call them out on their crap or whatever. Like if you're any race besides the Nord, you have to call them out on their crap. They're going. You, know, you say like um. Oh, what is it? What, you won't let me in because I'm not a Nord or something like that? And they'll say no, no, no. And we'll let you in and all that. But like. The Stormcloaks are kind of racist, but they're essentially the Rebellion, right? They're fighting the Empire, which, um, is ran by... God, it's so freaking long. I can't remember, but essentially, the, um, the 
Yeah, the Thalmor, War, thank you. I, I can't remember your name. But the Thalmor had a war with the Empire and they won. And so the Thalmor decided to ban the words Metalos and, um, whatchamacallit, the Stormcloaks, they still worship Talos because he is essentially the god of war. Like, he is the Ares of, um, I can't, I don't, Imperial walls. I don't know if it, um, Talos is part of an actual mythology or not, or whatever, but like, um, Ares in Greek mythology is like kind of comparing him to him, except he's less aggressive. Like he's he's just a god of war essentially, but um the Imperials, which we call, they kind of have to do whatever the Thalmor say, and the storm the Stormcloaks kind of think they they're on equal levels, and so they resent both the Empire and the Thalmor. The Thalmor a bit more than the Empire because they they do understand that the Thalmor above them, but they don't you know they don't choose to accept it. I, if I remember correctly. You've got to tell them we work with you. This is a mistake. Step towards the block. But um one at a time. Empire loves that. Freaking tired. I'm already stupid and it doesn't help when I'm tired. Yarls, yeah, yeah, yeah. They're like, um, think of Yarls as mayors. It's like, you know, you have a president, you know, he control, you know, he's essentially the head of our country. And then the mayor, they're like, um, they're in control of cities. So think of it like that. I, I think that's, I think it's a good way to, to, um, I think it's a good way to describe it. Bet ye. I can't Step move. <laughs> He's running. Get him. Who are you? Who are you? Okay. Um. Okay. I I kind of wish I was streaming, but it takes up so much freaking money, Leafy. No, I don't want to work. Um. Breton Dark Elf. Oh god, I did that thing 360, dude. Like, you stop and wants minute mid change. Or whatever, like. Like, it, you can't move it. Um. I'm thinking I want a battle character. Kind of. Mm, actually, actually, actually. I has an idea. A battle mage based around um, conjuration. Hmm. Hmm. I could do that. Bretons are awesome for that, and so are the high elves. And honestly, the dark elf is too, because you're supposed to mix, mix and match them um, melee with magic. Brightons, mm, I'd say they'd help with being a bit tankier. Which, mm, high elf or Brett? Sorry, I had a message. I'd answer that. Um, gosh, I'm tired and it's hard for me. Like, Usually these take a while, like this is pretty much, like this entire episode is going to be pretty much me custom customizing my character and going through the intro, and that is about it. And then after that, do not forget, comment down below what y'all want me to do, if y'all want me to, um, if y'all want me to make this a full playthrough. If I get five comments saying that y'all want me to do a full playthrough, then I will. Now, I will do Skyrim um, videos in the future, but... I will need five comments saying yes, you want to play through for me to actually do it. Um, I really don't like the high elves just because of the freaking. I'm gonna move my mic down a bit, my, just because it sound more. That was my phone. Excuse that. Never actually played as a wood elf. 
they are the only race that I have not played with. Is that racist? <laughs> um, I might make an archery character out of him sometime in the future. Mm. Dragon skin, dragon born, why not? Male or female? Generally, like, um... Actually, I have, I have Betzer idea. I has Betzer idea. I got this. I'm gonna go about here. Next way. Now, what I'm planning on doing actually is I'm gonna make um, a shield and sword character that that um, can swap out with magic here and there, like. Like, only powerful magic, not minor magic. Like I'll use minor magic to level up or whatever. But, you know. Complexion. Uh, oh, gosh. She just gets older. Okay. I don't really want the dirt, but I do want a want scar. Ooh, they really touched up the scars in them. The... What should we call it? The... Special edition. Yeah, they really touched them up. Where's that scar at? Oh, it's right there. Okay, I see. It. Like, it's, cr it's right there. Right there. Right under the left eye. Um. Uh, yours a little nick. Epic. <laughs> there, yeesh. <laughs> That's a scar. <laughs> I actually just I'm gonna do this one. I'm not a big fan of the war paint. Because I you sometimes mm, I'm not gonna have a helmet on, so But a lot of times I don't even do the red, the war paint. Oh, I screwed. Okay, so while I was at church camp, we had um, face paint, and I had my friend Kayla do a face, like, um, have a palm in the face, you know, kind of like the Dark Brotherhood. Like, with the middle finger going off the bridge of my nose. I should have done that. Dad gum it. I feel stupid. Okay, I'm not going to do face paint. Shadow and eyeliner stuff actually is really cool on the Argonians and the Khajiits. Like, you really notice it and it can, can really pop for your character. So I really enjoy that. Like, they have a lot more customization, and but they're not used too often.
Hi. What do I name you? Is my question. Maybe Tala? No. Hmm. Hmm. Thinking. Thinking, thinking. Thinking. I want something interesting. You know, not just a stereotypical girl name. Like, I don't, you know, like, like Sarah or whatever. I don't want, like, like I'm not trying to pick on any Sarahs. <laughs> I'm just saying, I don't want, you know, or an average, I don't want um, a, a common name. I think is what I'm trying to say. I'm not trying to talk crap or nothing. Just, I'm trying to think. And I'm already an idiot. And it doesn't help that I'm really freaking tired. Because I had a nap today and I'm running on two hours of sleep. Um. Talia. I've heard that name before. That was from Percy Jackson. That gummit. I'm getting messaged. Leyland? Layla or Layla? Layla. Nah. Layla. Now, um, it's kind of similar to you David's um, character, oh, Layla, but Captain, it's what still sounds pretty cool. She's not on the list. Forget the list. She goes to the block. By your orders, Captain. I'm sorry. We'll make sure your remains are returned to High Rock. No, you won't. Follow the Captain, prisoner. I do what I want. Go to the horse seat. No, I want to pet the pony. Before I die, I want to pet the pony. <laughs> Gosh. Oh, Rude. So I'm here in oh, Helgen. I forgot. A hero. But a hero doesn't use some power murder his king and usurp his throne. Well, a king doesn't catch an elf in the voice, so... <laughs> Skyrim into chaos. And now the Empire is going to put you down and restore the peace. Now, for those of you who didn't know, know the High King, he actually had a lot of respect for, um, Ulfric. Give them their last run. And freaking, As we commend your souls to it was it was barely even a fight. Like I can't remember where I heard this. It was um, this guy really knew his, like did his homework. Like he showed background facts and all that. He showed where he got the information. I just can't remember what. Um, not bow gaming. Let me go to YouTube. You say the same. Let me check my subscriptions. Shut up. You know, I like the Stormcloaks. I kind of side with them most of the time. Even though they're kind of stupid. I side with them. Oh, God, why me? Um, I'm going to find it. I don't care if I have to pause in a second. I said next prisoner. Make me peasant? Um, um, like the second I see the name, uh, second I see his name, I will remember. Like I will recognize it immediately because I watched the crap out of his channel. What do you see? I see you being a peasant. 
Mr. Rex, that's that's who he was. Mr. Rex, so he's a smart guy in Skyrim and he's on done something and all that. By the way, um in the 360 version, I don't know if it is this PS3, I don't know if it does um whatchamacallit, I don't know if it does it here. But um I'm not gonna spoil it for anybody who um hasn't played the game, but it, it says the dragon's name. Like, um, it'll throw in the subtitle. What is that thing? Oh wait, I forgot. Systems, settings, display, subs. But um, sometimes we'll save the dragon's name. Now, um, but only for that dragon. Like, um, the other dragons will naturally say their name. Right. Back off. Whoa, big book. There it is. It just says his name. See? Baldwin. Now, for those of y'all in the comments who do know, you know, what's it like, who do know Aldwin, you know, we all I'm gonna say is we're gonna see him, we see him later. But don't, you know, spoil nothing because Skyrim is a really good story. It's a little confusing here and there, but it is a good story. Now, um, there was a Skyrim animation. It was kind of like a Skyrim movie or whatever. And that was the boy's father right there. Like, he was trying to save him. I was like, oh my gosh. But I don't know if that's actually the case here. But I like to think it is. Just because of the movie. And watch, watch the Skyrim movie. The guy that did it did so freaking good. Oh my gosh. Um, I don't know what shot is that, but um, I'm waiting for him to use um Yul Katath, I think, or Yul Shatath. Is Yul Katath or Yul Shatath? That um, Yul essentially it was Yul that was fire. Yul, sorry, Yul. Y-O-L, Yol is fire, Rayloff, that was his name, that's our name, Rayloff, but it was like Yol Katoth or Yol Katoth or whatever, uh, I can't, I can't remember the freaking full shout, but um, essentially it was Yol something, that's the fire shout you get by doing the companion's quest line, and um, I personally enjoy it, and, it's, and part of can actually strengthen it. Cut me ropes. We'll meet again with the Sovereign Guard, brother. Although the Nords believe in Sovereign Guard is... Oh Looks gosh. Like the only it's kind of like it. heaven and um... That thing, <sighs> Let's see. A bunch of the Nords believe that only Nords can get in, but then there's other people who believe that everybody can get in. And if um, freaking... Come here. Let me see if I can get those bindings off. If uh, um, like... They believe they'll, they, um, they can get in if they're like they're honorable or whatever. Yeah. It's kind of like it was Norse mythology. Um, All right. get that armor it might have been Sovngarde that was um also there. Now the Bretons start off with Conjure Familiar, which is pretty cool. Uh, so, um... I'm gonna have to work up my Conjuration here and there. Actually, I'm not gonna use Conjuration. They're gonna come over here. Yeah, probably gonna make a tank character. I enjoy tanks. And there they come. come on, I kind of just couldn't stick it up. Surprise attack! Now with Skyrim, like, um, it doesn't. Oh, gosh. I'm changing the settings, it's too easy. Settings, gameplay. I'm 
go expert for now. Maybe one of these. Yeah, and then equip. I don't. I'm not gonna wear helmet. Equip. Equip. You come to the right. Imperial, got the key. Find the key. See if it unlocks that door. Shut your mouth, Brayloff, okay? Calm yourself. I'm looking around. They came here, like, my subs came here to watch, you know, scoot him. And I'm gonna show them scoot him. There's another Hogan Keep Key. Um, let me show y'all where. Um, open this garden right here. Um, this is where you come from if you go with, um, Hogger or something like that. I can't remember his freaking name, but, um,. Oh gosh, that that's mm, I don't use the Xbox. Like for playing Skyrim. But um yeah, you go through there. And alcohol is basically useless in this game. You can't really get like drunk or high or whatever, like um Skuma you technically get high or whatever, but um it doesn't affect your gameplay. Now if you're a red guard, you know, this place is awesome because you find a lot more gold. Like, you can find, like, I think it's, like, 20 some odd gold in just this little area right here. Like, between the chest and that spot right there. That, yeah. L1, yeah. L1's to up it. Find it. See if it unlocks that door. Shut up. If y'all don't ask for a full playthrough, then, you know, I'm, yeah, that's fine. I'm still going to show y'all the, um, the wooden plate glitch. Yeah. Alright, take all that. Guess take a bucket to show off that glitch. Alright, moving on. Done. Let's get moving. Shut up, Rayloff. You don't own me. Whoa, that's a buddy, that's a buddy. I forgot. Now this give you um they give you a set of lock picks, I can't remember how many, but um, this will give you four extra. With minor healing. The shield, yeah, they give you twelve so you can get a maximum of sixteen. Um items, apparel, iron shield. Now you, 
like, you see I move a little slower with it out. And then I move quicker with it in. Now I'm pretty good at um, picking logs. Now, I kind of get a feel for the log. Like it's not too terribly often that I break a log. Now you see that has a lot of value for not much weight. And so you want to be able to sell that later or disenchant it, whatever you want. I don't care what y'all want to do. Like, it's y'all's call. It was, um, books. Sparks. And this just for the extra XP. There we are. Yeah, I just kind of measure by how much it shakes. I don't like this. Like, honestly, guys, it's not worth it to level up your um, lock picking. I'm just doing this for free XP. But, um, so, like, it doesn't take much to learn how to lock pick. Like, you can do even, like, master levels when you don't have any points in it whatsoever. Like, you can be level 15 and do master locks if you know what you're doing. But I'm just grinding up some free XP. Which you kind of want to do in this area. You can sell that, like, on the other side of gold. But being a red guard at the start is freaking awesome for making making money. Like, oh my gosh. Um, this way. You get some decent, um, Potion crafting stuff. Come on, hurry up. Shut up. There will be some spooters up ahead, Orders right? Are to wait until General Tullius arrives. I'm not waiting to be killed by a dragon. Oh, I know. Need to it's pull back. some Imperials. Stormpunks, get them. <laughs> 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 Down there. Come on. Yeah, she's a I don't like that they're so freaking big. 
Yeah, because like, it's not like I'm grossed out by spiders. It's just, they're so freaking detailed. You see the like, thick and like, what should we call it? The thick hairs on them. Yeah, the spiders have those little hair things that help them stick to walls. Yeah, that's what helps them climb. Like, those kind of puncture stuff or whatever. I, I don't know how it works. Oh, ski retail. There's a ski up there. Where are you? Ski Yep. Nope, can't get up from there. Let's see if you have anything. Ah, uh, just more insects. One well, iron mace up here, in case you missed the. 30 or 40 back there, along with the iron swords. <laughs> no, you don't go up there, I'm just stupid. Come on, hurry up. Shut up, Rilof. Uh, so, over here, if you want to level up your sneak early, what you want to do is you want to find a way to push Rayloff into this corner right here on um, Crouch. And so y'all are both crouching, crouching. No matter how much damage you do to them, it won't be Hold hostile. So um, what should we call it? We actually stick around for zoom so you can get some free arrows. Right to sneak by. Watch where you step. Or longbow added 24, 20 gold, 12 arrows. by surprise. But if you attack her too early, I don't think you get the arrows and bow. six days by the time you'll see this maybe and whenever I said okay I will upload this tomorrow Saturday so it's tomorrow's the 22nd 23 24 25 26 27 20 on July 28th um, that is when I'll decide whether I'm going to do a full playthrough of Skyrim or not and I'll need five comments in this, on this video, right here, on this video, saying, yes, you want a playthrough of this character. Now, there will not be like a negative for someone to say, no, I don't want to see the playthrough. You know, that won't lower your score, you know. I'm just going to ignore that. Only yes. Like, if I see five yeses, I'll do it. But thank you guys so much for watching. And... <laughs> I will be doing a lot of Skyrim videos, you know, a lot of, you know, guides and glitches and whatnot, and, um, more than likely character builds, just, like, um, the, there's a, a boss that you unlock by being level 80 or something like that, 
maybe a 50, I can't remember, I'm tired. But whenever you're high enough level to be allowed to fight him, that that's when I, oh gosh, spoiler. <laughs> I'm kidding. But whenever you're high enough level to fight him, um, he's a DLC boss, by the way, but if you have, have the Legendary Edition that comes with the DLC, if y'all are on older consoles, like 360 or PS3, and y'all don't have the DLC, I'm sorry, guys, but, um, Whenever I do the do um, the first the the first vid, um, build video on it, you know I'll be talking about who it is for that government. But um, for those of y'all who don't know, you know I'll explain who it is. But he's part of the Dragonborn DLC. Is all I'm gonna say. And guys in the comments, don't spoil it for those who don't know. But again, comment what y'all want. It's comment if you want me to do a video, and I'll look on it next Friday. All right. Remember guys, Jesus loves you, and so do I. Bye!